Good morning everyone, hello there, my name is Pat and welcome to my channel Victorian Years. Um, before I start on the outfit I've chosen today, I just want to say a big, big thank you to my subscribers, hello, and um, thank you for still supporting me after well, this time, five months I started, which uh, seemed a long, long time ago, but it's not, it's not that long, is it? So uh, I'm still really enjoying it, but I have got you to thank for subscribing as well and watching my videos on a regular basis. It's really good that you still support me and I'm really grateful. Thank you. Um, and also um, to my new subscribers, I got quite a few new subscribers um, last week. Uh, from the video I shown this was spring and summer um, so I'm really really grateful and, and glad you enjoyed watching my video for the first time and I hope that you'll carry on watching all my videos in the future so a big thank you to everyone this week I'm, I'm really really grateful right I've just taken the dress off and left the polar neck on and um, it's a lovely polar neck, it's a lovely jumper, it's very fine, it's slightly ribbed, you can't really tell that it's ribbed, but it, it is, but just very slight. Um, and I think it's just a, a really, really nice jumper, looks a lot more expensive than, than what it was, and it was £16. Um, I think they do a couple of more colours in it, but I particularly like this burgundy colour, that's why I bought it. It's my sort of colour um, and it goes nice with black and cream so I tend to do go for this colour quite a lot. Um, I've got it on with my black wide leg trousers and just my black boots and I think it looks really smart with that. Hopefully you can see the bottom and yeah I'm really, I'm really pleased with that. As I say the price of that £16 is uh, is brilliant and um, I can just put my black patent bag on because I've got my black patent bell belt on with it and I think that looks really nice. Also while I was in Sainsbury's I saw this black gilet and um, I thought oh that's going to be so handy it's going to go with lots of things and you can wear it on cooling nights in the spring it still looks quite nice it's like a, um, a boucle material um, not overly thick but obviously it's going to keep you nice and warm it's an extra layer for you but with having no sleeves it's better for me for driving in because um, it gives me a bit more room uh, for driving so yeah pockets it's a one button fastener if you wanted to fasten it and it's a pop fastening actually which um, is quite handy like that so easy um yeah i like that i'll show you the bottom of it and show you how long it is because this will go nice with skirts dresses and um, obviously i've left my trousers on with it and the same jumper but i think that looks really really nice um very smart casual again but you i'll get lots of wear out of this i think it's going to be one of my favorite pieces in my wardrobe actually at the moment um but i just um, that's a bit low sorry i think i've cut my head off again but yeah, I think that's really nice. Um, that was £40. Okay, right, same jumper, but with a different skirt and just taking you into spring. Um, this is a fine jumper, so it can still be worn in the spring because some spring nights and days can be still a little bit cool. Um, I've took the polar neck right down so it looks a bit more like a crew neck. And um, I say I popped it on with a white skirt, so I'll just show you the bottom of that. There we go. And I've popped it on with my white stilettos. Can you, hopefully you can see those. And um, I think that looks really nice with it actually. And it just shows you from wearing the black to the cream how different it does look. Um, I have also popped on a little white belt just to take the darkness from the top just to give it a little a little bit of light to it and I've put my my beaded pearl bag Zara bag on with it and also if you do tend to be a little bit cooler which you can have some cool days and nights in in spring so you can always pop a little jacket on um, that just makes it look a bit smarter and also if it's a sunny day you can pop your sunglasses on and there you have a nice spring outfit another winter outfit and it's my cream coat and a nice beige scarf that i've put on and i've also got my cream or top boot should i say i'll put it down a little bit further 
so you can see them. Um, if I take this off, you can see that I've got a tracksuit underneath and um, that's really, really cosy underneath. I love wearing tracksuits under big coats actually. I always think they look, uh, they look really cosy and they do feel nice and comfortable. Okay, the same outfit but with more of a spring sort of look to it because it's it's quite a thin tracksuit is this um so it's lovely and cool um I got, this is one from tesco it's it's a nice top it, it goes gathered at the bottom there but it's got ties at each side which is quite handy and um yeah it's just really really comfy and and cool i'll just show you the bottom I've popped this cream bag on it because it's handy if you're just going out for, even if you're just going exercise, I've put my uh, calves in and, and uh, bone and things like that. So it's always handy to have a little bag uh, with a tracksuit. No, you don't have to if you don't want, but I, I tend to like to do that. So yeah, I love the colour top as well. As it is one of my favourite colours, tops and creams. I have mentioned it quite a few times. And, um, and also, if you feel a little bit cold around the neck, if it just come a bit nippy because sometimes that wind can start again you can just add a just the same scarf on and that goes quite nice with it and if you're lucky enough to have the sun shining then you can pop your sunglasses on as well and that's the finished outfit my next item is a winter one and um i put a scarf around my neck i've got a long black coat on and i think that looks really nice just some flat boots um it's a lot easier for walking in if it should snow we've not had any yet but you never know um so that's a nice outfit for when it's really really cold and um yeah i love this coat actually i think it goes nice with lots of things so i'll just raise it up and then you can see my head again so that's that one so um you don't have to wear the scarf you don't have to if you don't want depends how cold it is outside doesn't it I'm quite a cold person, so I tend to carry gloves, hats, scarves, everything. So there we go. And underneath the coat, if you don't want the coat on, I popped a big chunky jumper on. It's a bit like a mohair jumper, actually. And um, I think that looks really nice as well. And you could still put the scarf on and some gloves and maybe a black hat. Um, and that would, look, uh, that would look really nice and very, very cosy. Okay, to take the last look into spring, um, it's the same t-shirt, some more joggers. These are different joggers actually, these are a bit shorter in the length, so I don't tuck these down my boots, I've just paired them with my trainers. A lovely cool outfit for spring, and if you do a lot of walking or going on a picnic, that's ideal. Um, I do a lot of exercises, so this is probably what I would go to my gym class in. Um, I've got other tracksuits as well which I'll show you but this is one of the outfits I also sometimes put a black jacket on with it I know it's not a very good colour for spring but it is a very very thin um, cool jacket so I think that, to, that looks really nice as well and um, if you don't want to uh, wear black and you want to wear something lighter with it then if, I'll put my other jacket on which is my white one and I think this looks really nice with it because it looks more summery, I think. And you can still wear it with your black joggers. It can still look nice. Right, a dress from Stuart Sainsbury's uh, that I thought I wanted to show you. Um, I'm, I'm not too sure about this dress. Um, it's a nice dress. It's nice, but it's nice material. And um, I like the style of it. It's a shirt dress. Um, buttons down to the waist. Um, I've put a little belt on it because it's got a drawstring uh, tie which I, I don't like so I, I've put, just added a little thin belt to it. I've put my little flat boots on with it which is I think go really nice with it. Um, I'll show you the back. I've put this on, I will take this off and show you because it, it, you won't get the idea will you of the dress unless you see the back of it so i'll just pop let you have a quick look at the back and see what you think to be honest i'm not too keen on this one for me um i i don't think it's a me dress i don't think it suits me particularly um i put it on with the gilet and i thought it looked better with the gilet but i think there are some ladies out there that it will look lovely on and um and, and they'll like it but to me it's just it's not for me 
Um, I will be sending it back, unfortunately. And it's not often I send things back. I usually can tell whether I'm going to like something or not just by looking at it. But this, as soon as I put it on, it just didn't suit me at all. So, but never mind. I just wanted to show you. I didn't want to take it back and not let you see it because what's the point in me buying things? I wanted to show you because there will be some ladies that will probably really like it. And it'd be ideal for... Um, going out to lunch, going shopping in, because you can wear different polo necks. Also in the summer, you don't need to wear a polo neck. I put this on because it's cold. Um, you could wear, you know, take this off and just wear a neck, nice necklace and um, nice shoes with it. I've got boots on with it and nice shoes. Uh, but, um, and also you could actually, in the winter, wear different colored polo necks. I thought it might look quite nice with a cream one. Uh, it's, the zigzag material is um, like it's got a black and a cream line and a bit of mustard so the mustard would look nice underneath but anyway that's besides the point I just wanted to show you the dress I'm not going to be keeping it but I think it's fair that I show you it just in case some ladies might really like it and uh, it's very reasonably priced I think it was £20 uh, there are no pockets in it that's another thing that I don't like but uh, anyway um, as I say for the price it's it's a nice dress and um, I'm sure a lot of ladies will like it okay right another item from H&M uh, this very very pretty blouse very very flimsy um, and comfy and it'll be so cool, it'd be nice in the spring and summer to wear because it is really, really cool. I just paired it with my black trousers, I'll let you have a look at the bottom. Um, so it goes nice with trousers, it goes nice with a skirt, go nice with cream trousers, I might just think about that. Or uh, a cream skirt, and it's really nice. It fastens at the back now, that's just one niggle that I've got because the those little tiny buttons, covered buttons, which is nice, but there's those little tiny loops that you have to try, you know, lock onto the little buttons. And it is so difficult to get these little loops onto the buttons. So H&M, would you just make your loops a little bit bigger? Um, I've struggled with this for quite a while. I've had to turn it around and do it that way. And, um, oh, it's so annoying. So if they just fix that, these sort of blouses would be perfect. Um, it wasn't expensive. It's only a very reasonable price blouse. I'll put all the links at the bottom so you know uh, how much everything is. Um, it has got cuffs and it has got those same buttons on there. Can you see? But it's not as bad on the cuffs. It's just, you know, around the back, which is, makes it difficult. So there, finished. I've had my moan for today now. So that, that is it. But it's a lovely blouse, very pretty. And uh, I really like it. And I like the high neck as well. That's, that's nice. So, um, yeah, I probably would put, put my black patent belt uh, bag on with it because I've got my black patent belt on so that goes really nice and also if you are a little bit cool because this will be quite cool it'd be nice for spring actually um, you can always pop a little cardigan on now I've got this black cardigan which I've had for oh gosh ages um, and I, I don't wear it much but I just thought about it when I saw it in the morning I thought that'd be quite handy just to wear with a blouse so I popped it on with this blouse and um, I think that looks really nice, really nice. Then obviously put the bag back on and um, that's the outfit. Yeah, I like that now, it's really nice. Right, my very last outfit now, and I've ended with a spring outfit because it's my favorite time of the year. And um, I can't wait for it to be spring again, spring and summer, I just love. And I paired it with just a plain cream skirt that I've had for quite a while. I'll have to put the camera down so you see what I'm wearing it with. And I paired it with my top boots. I still wear boots sometimes in, in the spring, especially if they're sort of the light coloured ones like, like these are. So, um, yeah, that's it. Just a plain cream skirt and this nice silky blouse. And I think that looks really nice. I'll just pop my bag on with it. My, cream bag and I think that makes a nice spring outfit right we've come to the end of the video once more and um, I just want to say thank you again to everybody that's watching my subscribers and any new ladies that might have found my channel I hope you've enjoyed it today 
Um, it's been a different one today. It's been a bit mixed up, hasn't it? Um, I don't seem to have got into the flow. <laughs> That's what I usually do. But I, I really hope you've enjoyed it. I've tried to put a little bit of something in for everybody. Um, it's, it's quite hard trying to think what would suit one person, what would suit another and what they like and colours and things. So as I say, if anybody uh, has anything that they want me to, to, to show, any different colours, styles, uh, just let me know. I'd be really uh, happy to help. That would be wonderful. So keep the comments coming. I love that. I feel as though I'm getting really connected to a lot of my subscribers and it's wonderful when I look and I see the names and I think, oh yeah, it's, it's good to hear from you again. And it really is. So thank you very much. So for today, that is it. Um, I'll be back next week. So um, have a good weekend. Take care and I'll see you soon.